Um, so that if you guys remember the rules of exponents, the, uh, I'm sorry, the rules of logarithms, the first thing you guys want to do is whenever you are condensing, is we always want to be able to use our power rule, which was any time we have a number in front, we can always rewrite that as a exponent. So I always liked when I'm doing this, I always like to only do one rule at a time. Once you guys get really, really comfortable with this, you can start doing a couple rules at a time. I would highly recommend, as you guys are doing your homework and getting used to this, just do one rule at a time. So the first rule, which was in our notes last class period, is that any time we have a number in front of our logarithm, we can rewrite that as the power <coughs> of our values in our log of our logarithms. Now, using the quotient rule of logarithms, if we are subtracting two logarithms, I can rewrite that as the quotient now of one single logarithm. If you don't have the notes from last class period, I would 